So the green flag is shown at the back of the pack. Eyes to the gantry about to go racing once more in 2018. As the lights come on, the revs rise. And away we go. Terms with teammate Aldo Fastante. And they might well be teammates, but they're all out for each other. And now it's Fastante who runs by Benyar again, looking for the inside line. There's not a whole heap of space there. They give each other just enough room. They run side by side, though, as they head towards the last couple of turns on the lap. Fastante squeezing Benyar. Benyar has none of it and makes the move stick. Although Fastante will look to try and fight back through the final turn, Benyar parks the car in the middle of the road. He'll just compromise a little bit of exit speed there. And that might give the opportunity to Aldo Fastante to challenge. Indeed it does. The Italian tucked right underneath the Moroccan's rear wing. Just a third of the race to run. As the ill-helmeted Fastante looks to the outside of Michael Benyar. Benyar covers the inside line. Championship already. And well up in the overall standings. I think Aldo Fastante and Michael Benyar enjoyed that. They were certainly going wheel to wheel for much of the race. Fiscal for Termati Motorsport to the top step of the podium. It's been a good weekend for Aldo Fastante. Building on the potential that he showed in Estril. Likewise for Michael Benyar, the pace is there. I'm sure that consistent top 10 finishes will follow before too long. So excellent racing throughout the past couple of days here in France. We will be back on the 9th and 10th of June at Spa-Francorchamps for the 5th and 